the event is is um, not that uncommon. Um, just something as large as this is 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 relatively uncommon. Um, it's a, a chunk of rock um, entering the atmosphere, and what we see is uh, with when we see the really bright uh, meteor or a fireball is is not the object burning. It's it's the energy of the very high speed entry into the atmosphere, uh, ionizing gases in the in the atmosphere and producing a glow. Now. Um, once the thing gets lower down in the atmosphere, which the larger objects will do, um, then the surface of the uh, rock itself starts to be heated and you can see some of that. But most of the glow in the atmosphere, as I say, is ionized gas. Now, what we can hear when we hear the, the Big Bang is well after the object's passed over. And that's because that's the, the sonic boom from the uh, entry of the object coming in at higher than the speed of sound. Uh, so imagine just where you have an aircraft flying over and you hear it at supersonic speeds and you hear the sonic boom afterwards, it's just the same thing. But of course the object is probably 50 kilometers up in the atmosphere and so the boom may take um, you know, more than a minute to reach us on the ground. And the damage that's been reported is almost certainly as a result of that sonic boom. Any piece of rock that's, that's coming down will, with an object this size, reach the ground at, at terminal velocity. So maybe only um, you know, less than 200 miles an hour. There are some reports of people seeing pieces of rock landing. And if this is a typical kind of entry, but just a large version, what you'll find is that there'll be many fragments. There'll be a, a, what, what's called a field. Um, so there may be one very large piece, but then many fragments that have come off it. Um, and they'll be spread over a relatively large area. It's not that uncommon. Something as bright as this, um, as powerful as this, is probably not something that happens every year, but it certainly it's something that will happen every decade or so.